A nearly century old Queen City tradition kicks off today in North Charlotte. In just a few hours, Mallard Creek Barbecue will serve folks for its 93rd year. That's right. The barbecue is a big fundraiser helping out Mallard Creek Presbyterian Church, but also has a much wider impact than that. WCNC Charlotte's Destiny Richards has been there all morning long as organizers cook up all that delicious food. A little barbecue for breakfast, Destiny. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yeah, I wish I could have barbecue for breakfast right now, but it's all cooking right now. Everything just exploded, not literally exploded, but so many people have exploded getting to work um, just in the last hour. And we've got everything from sandwiches to slaw to stew to look forward to at this year's Mallard Creek Barbecue. We got to talk about that stew, though. With the stew master, Rusty Wallace, <laughs> good morning. Good Tell morning. us about the famous Brunswick stew. That's what everyone's going to be stirring up here behind us. Uh, so it's pretty special it's actually my great aunt's recipe um, it's actually been in our family all together a little over 80 years and then my father took it over but right now we're cooking the rice in the pots once we get that done we'll throw corn and tomatoes in once that comes to a good simmer and everything blends together well we'll uh, we'll add the meat and then we got a few other little special ingredients we'll put in there and once everything comes to a good good bowl, we'll, we'll pull it off and it's ready to eat. Yum. And I know there's a lot of preparation that goes into all the food. Does this have to be prepared days in advance as well, or does everything happen the morning of? So the barbecue actually started about two months ago as far as planning and, and ordering all the materials and supplies to, to get it done. And then it got really ramped up about a week and a half ago uh, where we started getting everything in and then actually setting up the production. And then we turn around and and started cooking the actual meat for the stew on Monday and uh, we put it together and we've already put up a bunch of stew early and got it in the cooling trailers so a lot of people come in and buy in bulk and we, we get that set up for them so they're not running out with a 20 quarts of hot stew but we've got some cold we're, we're gonna have some hot You're, you choose when you come through all right, awesome. Well, thank you so much for speaking with us about all that delicious My food. My pleasure. Thanks for coming. Yes, of course. And this is a great event because it's going towards a good cause. There are local missions that it supports. Then this year specifically, it is going to support those in Western North Carolina who are recovering from Helene. So what better way and what better time to come and get some good barbecue? Dine In returns this year so you can drive up, you can walk up, or you can dine in and enjoy some good fellowship. I'll send back to you guys. They make it very easy for you. All right, 93 years in county. Destiny, thank you.